Hello, in this video we're going to look at a, a type of nucleophilic acyl substitution reaction called the base catalyzed uh, transesterification reaction. And this is probably the supla, superest, simplest uh, nucleophilic acyl substitution mechanism you're going to see. Uh, and it allows us to turn one ester into another. Okay, and for this example, um, I'll just start with kind of a simple ester here. So ethyl, ethyl propionate. Uh, we're going to take that and if we react it with methanol, MeOH, and sodium hydroxide, uh, what we'll get is a methyl ester. Okay, like so. And the mechanism of this reaction is what I'm going to show next. Now, uh, one thing I, I want to say about this, otherwise you're going to wonder why something's going the way it is in the mechanism. Uh, when we put the sodium hydroxide and the methanol together in the same flask, they're going to react in an acid-base reaction, okay, a Bronsted-Lowry acid-base reaction to make water plus sodium methoxide. Okay, and it's the sodium methoxide that you're going to, especially the methoxy, that you're going to see in the mechanism of this reaction. <clears throat> okay, and the mechanism is going to look like this. Mechanism. Okay, in our, in our first step, have our methoxide lone pair nucleophile, the sodium, is a, a spectator ion. It's not participating in the mechanism. Uh, the first step is going to be a nucleophilic addition. And that's going to get us to a tetrahedral intermediate. that methyl group from the OME. Okay, and then in the second step of this mechanism, the methoxide is going to leave as a leaving group and we call that nucleophile elimination. And that's going to get us to this methyl ester uh, and then plus OET minus, okay, sodium ethoxide. All right. Now you might, you might at this point ask why we would want to turn one ester into another ester. And um, there may be a couple of reasons why. Uh, one reason I can think of is if you were trying to make biodiesel as a fuel uh, from uh, oils. So. Um, some oils have uh, what are called triglycerides, which are basically three esters kind of uh, stitched together. And if you do a transesterification of triglycerides with sodium hydroxide and methanol, you make the methyl esters, and then you can uh, use those in a diesel engine and combust them. Uh, all right, that concludes our uh, video lecture on base catalyzed transesterification. Thanks for watching.